My parents informed me that I was going to be moving to Korea to avoid COVID and virtual school and all of that. Actually, one week before we were supposed to leave. So up until that week, I thought we were going back to Houston, but then suddenly I was coming to KIS. Hi, my name is Ian. I'm a junior and I'm from Houston, Texas. I was extremely nervous and I was extremely scared for what I had to bring both academically, socially, extracurricularly, just because it's high school, right? But as soon as I came to KIS, I felt like um, everything sort of fell into place. I kind of transitioned pretty smoothly. I feel like through activities such as cross country, for example, um, I was really able to sort of um, fit into KIS right away. And um, through like, of course, we still had um, meets in Korea and that was available and that really allowed me to compete and link with other people. And I feel like a lot of people think running is an individual sport, but there's this famous, uh, not famous, but there's this quote that Mr. McKelvey says, you're only as fast as your slowest runner. So I feel like that really, you know, pushes team culture into a culture that's accepting, that's encouraging of others. And that focuses more on the team and not the individual. Because of KIS, I feel like I was able to foster a lot of values that will probably stick with me uh, throughout the um, throughout my life, actually. So for example, um, in cross country, back in the States, it was a lot more structured. There was a lot more Saturday practices, weekend practices that we were obliged to come to. But at KIS, I feel like there's this sort of sense of individualism where it's sort of, um, there's some guidance, but there's also some self-guidance as well. So you're really able to, you know, develop your personal self-discipline skills and sort of guide yourself through that, through the path that you want to go to.